T minus 35 seconds. Gallons is go for auto sequence start. In the next few seconds, thousands of gallons of water will be dumped on the platform to help absorb the shock of the 7 million pounds of thrust produced by the shuttle. Fifteen. Minus 15 seconds. 12, 11, 10, 10 9, 8, 8, 7, we are go for the start. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Booster ignition and liftoff of Atlantis on a mission to study planet Earth. Roll program, Houston. On your roll, Atlantis. Houston now controlling. Atlantis is underway on its 13th trip to space, rolling on course for a 57-degree formation orbit for highly north and south and climbed orbit at an altitude of 160 nautical miles. Atlantis speed is already 350 miles an hour. Three engines on Atlantis are now throttling back to two-thirds throttle to prepare the spacecraft to pass through the area of maximum air pressure and go supersonic. Five seconds since launch, Atlanta speed now 1,000 miles an hour. Altitude seven miles, five miles east of the Kennedy Space Center. Go throttle up. Roger, go throttle up. Atlanta's three main engines are now back at full throttle. All systems on the spacecraft are go. One and a half minutes since liftoff, Atlantis has already burned more than two and a quarter million pounds of propellant and weighs less than half of what it did at launch. Atlantis altitude 84,000 feet, 12 miles northeast of the Kennedy Space Center. Atlantis speed now 2,200 miles an hour. Flight controllers are standing by for burnout and separation of the twin solid rocket boosters. Booster officer confirms a good separation and jettison of the twin solid rockets. Atlantis now on its second stage. Its three main engines continuing to operate well at full, full throttle. 